Hey Summers! Hi everyone! Welcome to Make 2 in the next part of the Glitz and Glam update. This is the Fashion Hunter Hobby. So first, to get the Fashion Hunter Hobby, we need to unlock this section of the mall's new floor. This is called Memory Lane. It takes 4 hours and 25,000 simoleons, adding a town value of 25,000 simoleons. And it includes a variety of stores for teens and adults, a photo booth for capturing memories and a second escalator connecting to the first floor. And at the end of this corridor is the movie theatre, but that will obviously be unlocked differently. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Yeah. Okay, so we've done that, and now it just looks like a massive cleanup operation. So we're going to do that and cut back in with the finish of the cleaning. Okay, so we've done massive cleanups, and now we've got a whole bunch of green bubbles for unlocking these shops and storefronts. Yeah, on one side. The other side is still messy and still locked. So we'll start with this store. Legit. 12 hours, 165,000 simoleons. Maybe just the store for your soon-to-be-hip male teen sims. Ooh, classy. Look at these sports coats. And what is this Hair they are like MC of, Hammer. Uh, like what? And why are the shoes so big? They're like clown <laughs> shoes still. <laughs> oh. Okay. Mandolin's Boutique. This will be for adult female sims. Cost 16 a, hours yeah. and 120,000 simoleons. I think that the adult female sims are really cleaning up with this update. They're getting a lot of stuff. More scarves. Yeah, scarves are in. Look at these like corset tops. Style patterns. Wow. Those are Pretty. a little bit risque. <laughs> Look at those big clown feet shoes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. K thinks bye. <laughs> Crazy and wild pop culture fashion is available inside for your teen female sims. They must see to believe it. 16 hours and 120,000 simoleons. This is a veritable smorgasbord of clothing. Sailor outfits. Ooh. But no boy sailor outfits. Oh, look at that. Oh, what are those uh, pop sock things? Where? Oh, yeah. like, ah, oh, what are they called? Leg warmers. Yeah. Yeah. Are they making a comeback? <laughs> oh, and look at those. I mean, what's okay for the slippers? The rest, yeah, interesting shoes. Yeah, I'm like, is this what the kids are wearing these days? <laughs> okay. Alright, electric kapow. If your teen male sims need to express themselves, give them a pocket full of money and send them inside this wild store. Eight hours and 135,000 simoleons. Man, these are some really bright colors that are getting... <laughs> <laughs> what are these shorts? Uh, that's funny. Well, what are those socks? Yep. Kind of a mix between the 80s and the 2000s, I think, in this the whole fashion mm -hmm. that we've got. Yeah, like if your Sims want to walk around dressed like boy band members, cool. Yeah. Okay, we've got a few other green padlocks. Okay, well, let's try this one Cinema Court. Oop, what just happened? So that unlocked the second side mm. with more cleanup, but before we do the cleanup, let's do this. Unlock the, the photo, photo booth. booth. Haha. <laughs> now can we use the photo booth? Sure. Okay, what's is she just gonna go I think she's gonna go inside. I guess we can't follow her inside. No. Then what happens? Do we get to see some photos? Uh, I'm guessing not. Wow. Come on, man. Wait for partner? Friends photos? Sure. Nothing. How disappointing. Aww. <sighs> Let's do the escalator. I mean, if it just connects the two, is it really necessary? 
I guess we can build it, but I'm not sure that it is all that necessary unless it unlocks something else. Yeah. So we're now going back to clean up. Okay, so we finished cleaning up and now we've got this area ready to go. Fashion Hunter Bargain Center. 8 hours, 15,000 simoleons, it will unleash incredible fashion deals upon the Sunset Mall. Once built, Sims can participate in the Fashion Hunter hobby from any open storefront, clothing rack, or the Bargain Center. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Maybe you can have more than one doing it at once. That would be helpful. Because there's a lot of shops. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so that begins the Fashion Hunter event, which is a seven day limited time to do the Fashion Hunter hobby collection. And you get the indoor skydiving wind tunnel if you do it within the seven days. If you don't, then you will still get the movie theater unlocked and open. So yeah, it looks like similar to the makeup artist hobby, as you complete each of these rows, you will unlock a new store on the other side of this little area. So let's see what happens. Hunt for fashion. Five hours and 30 minutes. <laughs> Why is she running? Looking for bargains. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> yeah, so for the first time through the collection, you need to probably just focus on getting one sim to the highest level in the hobby so that okay. all of the collection items are unlocked and available. But after that, in order to keep getting through the hobby, you can certainly devote as many sims to the hobby as you want to. So let's go ahead and see what happens when we unlock the first three. Okay, so it took us about six times to get the first <laughs> yeah. three items in the collection. Yowzers. But it now means that we can open up this one. Wow. 16 hours and 180,000 simoleons, but this is for adult male sims. Mmm, look oh, at these. Look at the nice pea coats. Mm. More scarves. Rolled up trouser bottoms, okay. Mm -hmm. And big shoes. So for the second row, it took us five tries to get three items. And the store we unlock is Friday night. Your female sims will be turning heads everywhere they go with the stylish and formal clothing lines inside a whole day. 225,000 <sighs> simoleons. Ooh! Look <laughs> at all that! Mm, it's interesting. Look at this! Are these skirts? They are... They are short. Short, short. Oh, here, here you go. Classy shoes. Classy You've shoes. only been wanting them for about half a dozen stores now. <laughs> so, there you go. Ah, this store is for me. <laughs> So for the third set, it took us five tries to get three items, and now we can build the Jack and Jill store, which looks to be for, not sure what age, but... Tweens. <laughs> tweens. 16 hours, 140,000 simoleons. I didn't know we had tweens. Preteens. Oh yeah, of course we do. <laughs> I feel like we haven't had any preteen stuff so far yet in the update, so it's nice to have some of this. But what is this dropped crotch trousers situation going on here? Oh my goodness. So the fourth and final set was really difficult. Seven tries for three items. And the summer to winter store is now available to build. And congratulations, grab some popcorn. The movie theater is now available on the second floor. Congratulations, you've received indoor skydiving. Head on up to the second floor to try it out. So this is what the collection looks like filled up. And if you hit reset the collection, you then move on to just getting three LPs every okay. time. That's quite good to know, at least there's no extra tasks to get more clothes. So one day to build the summer to winter store for 150,000 simoleons. Nice. Yeah. 
and classier shoes again. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Does it meet your Good exacting empathy. standards? So for the skydiving, which we'll check out now, um, it's going to cost 10,000 and take six hours for a town value of 2,000. The problem is if you don't manage to complete this in seven days, which, you know, may be really difficult mm. because, yeah, it's a tough hobby, you're going to have the constant reminder in the mall of yeah, this. this unsightly Yeah, normally thing the under things you win are just stuff that you just don't get in your home store, whereas, yeah, it's a little bit... But wait for partner. Come on, Dude, lady. What is, is taking person? you so long? That is a problem with the mall. It is so big. Yeah. And these sims walk so slow. All right, so you've got to have your first sim waiting oh. for a partner. Oh, she's put on a special protective helmet. Nice. Okay. And then you can now bring your second sim to do a tandem skydive. So let's just wait half an hour. For them to get for there. For sim to arrive. <laughs> It's a good thing we built that, that second escalator. Oh! Ooh. That's more of a fancy change. So how come... And maybe she's already dressed for it. <laughs> it's like, uh, what's that? Charlie and Chocolate Factory. Yeah. With Charlie and his grandpa almost getting skewered by fans. Well, cute! Okay, so let's check out the cinema. 12 hours and 100,000 simoleons. Cool. 50 simoleon movie and popcorn ticket yeah. for 3 hours and 30 minutes. Okay. That should be interesting. Can we have more? Can someone else do that as well? Ooh. Here's a little interaction. So we'll see what happens with all the sims once they get there. And then in here, we've got a pirate movie playing. <laughs> That's a really cool effect. Okay, so it looks like... I think they should be getting their food and then going into the cinema. Yes. So then you can have other people... Can you click on the seats to have somebody sitting in there? Join movie date. Okay. So let's have the Joker and Batman be on a movie date together and see what that looks like. Yeah. One sim chooses the romantic option and goes to take their seat, and then you have a second sim come and join them on their date. Oh, yeah. how sweet! Wow. Oh. <laughs> Are they going to share popcorn? Oh my. It's getting a little warm in the movie theater. <laughs> <laughs> That's so strange. <sighs> well, I think overall this has been a really cool addition, or set of additions, to the mall. I think it now feels much more like a proper mall. So yeah, yeah it's yeah. been cool. And I've seen some rumors on Facebook and other Sims Replay discussion areas that there will be more content coming from this update. There will be a limited time event based around new rugs. So mm. we don't know when that will happen exactly, but stay tuned because we'll certainly be doing a video for it. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this walkthrough of the fashion hunter hobby and this new section of the mall. Please let us know in the comments what you think, and feel free to subscribe if you're new to our channel, because we've got more Sims Freeplay content on the way. Thanks for watching!